Scorpio what is going on with you guys so this is going to be a general reading for the month of June if you have Scorpio anywhere in your chart this reading is for you cross watchers are welcome remember their roles can be reversed and if this video does not resonate with you check your other placements and look at the videos for those zodiac signs as well all right so Scorpio let's get into it your energy is coming up strong here okay a lot of you guys are manifesting something through your desires, through thinking about it, through praying about it, and you don't even see it. You don't even see it coming, but it, it's coming. For some of you, you need to watch out with what you're thinking because you could be manifesting something that you don't want because you're focusing on it too much. Something like that is going on. All right, so let's see here. Taking a risk. What are you guys taking a risk on? Someone here is making a decision to be honest about something, whether, it, whether this is uh, with themselves or with someone else. But it's definitely feeling like a risk to you guys or this is how someone is feeling towards you it's like will someone allow me to come towards them or will something allow for me to take this risk finding avenues that will make it happen Okay, the numinous mystery, the unknown. Yeah, someone is walking into the unknown, taking action towards someone that they may love. After doing some healing, figuring out they have passion for a person, for an individual. Okay, following their intuition. Um, doing some shadow work here as well. Tapping in, picking that up. All right, Divine Feminine, let's see. Someone here is not recognizing that they know they deserve the best. Okay, doing doing a lot of um, healing in their dreaming, in their dream state. Okay, that Kundalini energy, I'm picking that up very strong, this intimacy card. Okay, so somebody here could be activated or just they they got activated somebody was activated okay with the kundalini energy now they're needing to ground themselves because they could be not knowing what's going on with them ascended masters are guiding me okay this is the time though picking that up This is the time. This was the time for someone to do this or for someone to, t to tap into this. Tingling sensations. Okay, so someone here gives another person tingling sensations. Okay, makes them feel oneness with the other person. Someone here could be opening themselves up to psychic abilities here by who they're sleeping with. Or who they're interacting with intimately. So it doesn't have to be six, but this person could just, their energy could just be so strong that it causes the other person to um, tap in. Yes, I am going through a spiritual transformation in the divine masculine, <laughs> divine masculine energy. Oh my gosh. Scorpio, what have you gotten yourself into? Okay, so you guys, this is definitely real. I am going through a spiritual transformation. Y'all, excuse my folks. Yes, you guys manifesting. You you guys are manifesting something, Scorpio.
wish fulfillment okay you're walking away from something somebody here is walking away from something walking away from a old way of thinking or walking away from a connection that wasn't serving them or that put them in distress or something like that they connected to someone or they connected with someone intimately and now they have been trapped in this um i'm not going to say trapped but they have been awakened to all types of things They went from the Eight of Cups into the Nine of Cups. They walked away from something after something was illuminated to them. Knight of Cups. King of Pentacles. Chariot. Seven of Pentacles. I'm trying to make sure this is uh, straight for y'all. Or straight enough. <laughs> Five of Cups. Ooh. Yeah, somebody was like investing in something that was only bringing them like heartache, heartbreak, um, ill health. They weren't seeking justice. The only thing they were they were gaining was nothing. They weren't getting anything. Somebody here was not getting anything. They retreated or they had to go into hermit mode. Somebody here was maybe dealing with a Gemini person. They had to close the cycle out with this person. There was there was maybe too much conflict here. Okay, somebody here was being blocked from their healing or blocked from their true emperor status. Somebody here was not feeding that part of them. Okay, so like I said, the only thing someone offered was a bunch of nothing. All right, they came in with a lot of promises. They failed. They did not come through. They did. They definitely did not go through with whatever it was that they promised. Okay, they only offered betrayal, destruction to someone's finances or stability here. They maybe even made a decision to move forward or move on from another, from this person, from this same person that they made promises to, okay, to go and invest in something that only brought them mental conflict or that will bring them mental conflict. Yeah, someone is definitely going through something right here. loss grief betrayal destruction a judgment call here or someone is going through judgment and is definitely having them like up at night insomnia can't sleep or they can't get it off their mind they had to walk away though to receive justice they had to walk away because it wasn't serving them whatever this was Okay, but I do see somebody about to walk into something once they do this shadow work or the risk risk they're taking. They're about to walk into something that um, someone is going to be putting the time and energy into them the same way. Or there's going to be a equal give and take in this new connection that's going to offer um, stability or justice. Good karma. A victory finally someone is walking clean slap into a victory after feeling heartbreak after a decision wasn't made on them wow someone is definitely going through a transformation Someone is realizing that they were betrayed. They may have been waiting for an offer from someone that they didn't realize betrayed them. Okay, this someone here may be wanting to make an offer. to someone that maybe they left behind for this person who pushed them into a spiritual awakening
definitely going through a transformation though Scorpio you have a decision to make two of cups a new connection okay that you know is more stable okay moving on from whoever this person is that brought a tower moment but you're realizing something about another person or about a connection that you should have invested in and kept your promise for because indulging in something else ended up in a third party situation or loss you lost someone you ended up losing a connection with someone someone here ended up losing a connection with someone or betrayed a person that was actually stable by being foolish somebody here was being foolish all these uh, major arcanas out here definitely a transformation is going on the strength someone cannot get this person off their mind they cannot restrain from whoever this person is mentally they keep thinking about commitment with whoever this person is um, that they left away from or that they lost that they have that they're having a realization about now that they want to go towards and make this offer towards and hopefully the wheel will turn in their favor Yeah, somebody wanted to continue to linger in third-party situations when they had a two of cups. They went to a three of cups, not realizing they had someone that was like very knowledgeable. Someone that would show them everything they needed to see, everything they needed to feel, everything they needed, period. This person had it. Now this person may be gone off in the wind somewhere else, okay? And they're having a rude awakening about this, and they're wanting to go toward back towards it again. They feel like they were foolish. Somebody here feel like they made a foolish decision because they went right into a tower moment. They, whatever they moved forward with, was a tower moment, okay? But somebody here is going to have a strong connection or a strong commitment that they're like thinking about investing in that they can't get off of their mind they want to leave somebody here wants to leave the third party or leave the indulging leave the partying or whatever this is fast life behind and go enjoy freedom and happiness with this person who exudes so much strength gracefully because it just came to them through this when they had this spiritual awakening it just came to them that they want to go down this path of marriage or commitment with whoever this is Scorpio wow something blew up though or something happened to help someone to go towards the new beginning because somebody here is going to get another chance but for some of you this is over you have to go towards another connection all right so marriage here yes somebody is bringing true fulfillment true stability a true commitment wanting to go back towards this person they feel like if i go back towards this i have to come correct Okay, I have to leave out whoever this other individual was or is that I'm investing in right now. Somebody here could be in a long-term commitment with a person, but they cannot stop thinking about you, Scorpio, or Scorpio, this is you in the connection. You can't stop thinking about another person. Like, they're strongly on your mind. Someone here thought they were, thought, thought they were all of that in a bag of chips. They thought they could afford losing someone, not realizing that this person was all of that. This person was the whole package. Now they're wanting to go back towards this person after losing them, after realizing they caused destruction with themselves by ending it.
with that person, okay, that they're wanting to go back towards. Okay, someone here could feel trapped in their relationship. They could feel held back from that person they really want. They could feel like they can't get to this person. Maybe this person is in a new connection. Maybe this person has a family with someone else. Maybe this person will be shocked if they come towards them to let them know how they feel now. Maybe this person is maybe thinking maybe I could come back into this person's life and conceal my true feelings just to be close to them again. This person is bound by the thoughts of this other person. Literally, they cannot shake it. Even though the ending has been here. For some of you, this ending has been here for a while. This person cannot shake it. They're still trapped, imprisoned by these thoughts about you. Someone here wants to be bold enough to come towards you. And for some of you, they, they will. For some of you, they are not going to do so <laughs> because they're scared. They don't even know what's happening to them. A lot of them literally want to stop investing in the connection that they're in right now to come back towards you. They could be finding out you're in a new commitment. They could be finding out you're in a new marriage. They could be finding out you're in a new business opportunity. They could be finding out that you're pregnant. This person could be born in September. This person could definitely be a Libra. Yeah, this could be somebody that is no longer in your life. They're definitely not in your life for a lot of you. Something could have ended with them in September, or this could be somebody that is born in September. This person could come back in once they have some type of solid foundation. I mean, and it's set up the way they want. They may feel like they have to increase their efforts to get your attention. Yeah, they may feel like they need to have good fortune. But I do see something new coming in for you. Or I see something new coming in for someone once they do close out a cycle. They can then take the risk or make this judgment call on something. After an ending takes place. Or they could leave from feeling stuck after an ending takes place. Yeah, honor and respect will come to you. Spiritual love. This person is realizing that they are deeply spiritually in love with another individual that they didn't even understand who this person was or something. They were overlooking this person in the past. Looking at something else or paying attention to something else. Yeah, spiritual guidance, protection from harm. Time to act. Now, for some of you, like I said, this person's not gonna come in because they know that is they know it's done. They know it's done for they know it's not gonna work because someone is so prosperous in their new connection that they know that this person is not going to do something stupid like mess over the person that they're with to go back to another individual that messed them over in the past. For some of you, someone here could be trying to hurry up and take action towards you before you get into a new connection. Or before you get too deep in the connection. They're trying to figure their way back into your life. This could be an older man. This could be someone older than you. That you left from or they left away from you because maybe you weren't granting their wishes. 
Maybe they saw their wishes being granted with another individual that was really irrelevant. Someone that caused destruction and tower moments in their life very easily um, without care. Yeah, someone that was very arrogant and boastful that they went towards that hurt them. <clears throat> that only wanted plenty of material things. We're dealing with other men or other women while they were in a financial pinch, being a bat secretly, okay, causing disappointment and great personal sorrow because they were goal oriented and then oriented and then care about anybody else but themselves. But you're gonna have somebody to boast and be arrogant about. You're going to have honor and respect come to you with someone new in your life. Okay. This person is going to be looking at you for looking at you like, wow, this person turned out successful. This person is now very fortunate. Now I'm realizing the love I have for this person after being hurt by another individual that I passed them over for. I passed them by for. Now I see how much I love this person now that they're in the spotlight and receiving honor and respect. Oh, wow. Yeah, so Scorpio, either you're going through this transformation and you're allowing things to take place. You're allowing this new relationship to come in. You're allowing yourself to be spiritually guided here. Or this is taking place. And now you're free. And this past person is now seeing you in this light. They can't handle it. They don't even know what to do. Someone trying to become, trying to come between you and something you and a friend or something you want. Yeah, that's going to be an obstacle for them to overcome. Because you're not going to be hearing that. This And some of them only want to come in because they want to see if you if you have changed or not. Some of them only want to come in for sexual, sexual matters. Okay? Some of them are going to come in and try to crank you up. But you're long gone. Okay, try to see they're they're going to try to test your temperature. Things like that. You're long gone from that. Okay, you don't deal with that. You're spiritually protected from whatever this is, Scorpio. This this was good. Now that person is now that person is realizing your worth. Now that person is realizing how special you are. They didn't look that deep within you before. Okay, just like they're saying, they didn't know what they had until you were gone. Oh, wow. You stepped out of your comfort zone. You did some healing and you took a new leap of faith towards a new romantic cycle. And whoever you're moving forward, they're giving you everything you want. They're actually coming through with the promises that they're making. So let's see what Moonology has for you. A fiery com climax approaches. A new start is coming. It definitely is. I feel like this person is going to love you. They're going to give, give, give. Because you were serious. You weren't playing any games. Yeah, you knew nothing was going to come out of the situation. And you knew that you needed to release it. If you don't know, this is this is going on right now. This is about to happen. You knew, okay, I have to have a practical plan to move forward to, for me to reach a resolution. And you did. You did. You communicated about it. You didn't let your past hold you back. Because you knew that nothing was set in stone. You knew that. You knew that you were good enough. You knew that you would receive the answers once you took action and showed the world the real you. You would get a win-win outcome. And you knew luck would be on your side once you surrendered to the divine because you were going to be okay. You knew that prosperity, prosperity was ahead of you. You didn't let your pride get in the way. Okay, You stayed balanced until the end of the situation passed. Until you got over like all of the grief of the situation, you believed in a you believed in healing, okay. 
and it is now paying off so you need to expect like something big is going to happen for you scorpio or cross watcher all right so these were your messages if this video resonated with you please like share and subscribe let me know down in the comments what's going on and i'll talk to you guys later